The cryptocurrency world is a volatile one, but one roller coaster you don't want to get caught on is a pump and dump. Fortunately, pump and dump schemes have telltale signs that make them relatively easy to spot. In this video, we'll show you how to identify a pump and dump in cryptocurrency so you can avoid being blindsided. Pump and dump schemes are when people work together to inflate the price of a low value cryptocurrency or token by buying in mass at the same time, waiting for other unsuspecting investors to FOMO into the asset and then selling their positions when the price rises to a certain level. Pump and dump schemes in the TradFi world are illegal, but since most cryptos are unregulated, crypto pump and dump schemes operate in a legal gray area. They are morally dubious, to say the least, as they rely on deceiving unsuspecting buyers and using them as exit liquidity. This type of scam starts off with a pump phase, when large holders of an asset, such as project developers or early investors, hype up the project, often with exaggerated claims and promises of riches on social media platforms like Twitter, YouTube, or Telegram. With time, more and more people buy the asset, causing its price to skyrocket. What follows is called the dump phase, where the original investors liquidate their holdings as soon as the asset reaches a certain price and run off with huge profits. The dump phase usually happens fast, with the asset's price falling significantly, leaving those who got in late with no choice but to sell as well and wind up taking heavy losses or having their holdings go essentially to zero. A recent pump and dump example can be seen on the altcoin Sonom, an old 2017 project that offers cloud services and other hardware. On November 20th, the Sonom token surged by almost 7,000%, hitting a new record high of $13.90, after which a vicious market sell-off ensued the next day, collapsing the price by over 90% to $1.03. And while some were able to get off early, others weren't so lucky, which is why you should always be on the lookout for obvious red flags. Like if a cryptocurrency is suddenly getting a lot of attention on social media, especially via bots, or is being shilled endlessly by celebrities or influencers. The assets in question often have low liquidity or are from obscure or zombie projects most people have never heard about. Sometimes these pump and dump schemes are not orchestrated by the project itself, but simply targeted by pump and dump groups. Most of all, sudden and massive price hikes of up to hundreds or thousands of percent are almost always good indicators of a pump and dump. So this is a good enough sign to stay away. At the end of the day, the best way to protect yourself from financial risk is to take no shortcuts, DYOR, and don't participate in anything that sounds too good to be true.